downtown to Wilkinsburg and beyond communities all around the area. Honoring Dr. King's life and legacy today, Royce Jones is live with how people are remembering the civil rights leader. Royce. Ken, good evening. In recognition of this federal holiday, many office buildings were closed. However, those who had off work today spent the day serving their communities in Dr. King's image. The measure of a man is what he can do for others. On this day of service, volunteers are feeding the dream of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. and over 500 families with this free food distribution along First Avenue downtown. We're basically in a modern day Great Depression right now and it's just great for us to be able to do something like this for the communities that really need it. In the words of Dr. King, one of life's most urgent questions is what are you doing for others? Something organizers of this distribution feel everyone should be asking right now. We can go into communities to help clean it up, do things like this, you know, um, because people are facing hard times right now. Like and from the food line to the prayer line. Dr. King was very clear the only way to cast out hate is with love. Religious leaders organized this prayer motorcade in Wilkinsburg, praying for peace and sharing the wisdom of Dr. King. I don't care who you are as long as you love people. We're all Americans. A dream civil rights activists feel has never been more important to our reality. If we don't find a way to uplift all boats, talk about racism till we break down the systemic things that created this race relation war. If we don't do that, we're going to lose the greatest country that was ever formed, and that's the United States of America. And Dr. King once said, our lives begin to end the day we become silent about the things that matter. Let that one sink in. Those we spoke with today do say that people need to stay consistent with their mission to speak out against racial injustice. It can't end today. Reporting live downtown, Royce Jones, KDKA News.